Hey guys, what's up? I'm Ultron. Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, we are back with another Fortnite bundle review thing. And then this bundle review, we will be taking a look at two bundles technically, but they go together. So I'm going to go this one. We're looking at the Legends of the Light and Dark bundle, along with the Legends of the Light and Dark gear bundle. Which, if you don't know what this is, it's Destiny Cosmetics. As you can see, we've got Commander Zavala, Ikora Ray, the Extra Stranger, along with the Investigate Emote, the Lamet Sword, the Crown Splitter Sword, the Black Talon Sword, and the Sparrow, which is three different styles that I'll show off. So yeah, that is what we're going to be looking at in this video. If you like that, or like this, hit the like button, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys know when I go live and when I upload all that good stuff. And yeah, let's go into the... Um... That was such a flawless intro. <laughs> let's go into the replays and start by looking at Zavala, even though you can kind of see him here in the lobby. So yeah, let's get to it. So, taking a look at uh, Zavala, we are in the creative mode map that they brought in for this as well. You can see, very nicely done, his face is a bit eerie looking, and the weapons kind of glitch through his armor the way he's standing. But, I think that's just a slight bug. But nothing terribly bad. Um, you see, it's Titan armor, very nicely done. This arm has like the big fucking block of a shoulder pad, and this side has the not so bulky one. Um, got his chest insignia thing there, pretty cool. Good down, got leg armor and boots. For his sword, or his pickaxe, he has the sword. Um, I said it in the intro, put it up in the corner of the screen somewhere, just in, you know exactly what it is. Um, it's pretty cool looking, it kind of reminds me of the Master Sword a little bit from Zelda, but that is besides the point. Still very nice looking. Um, you can see how it swings, very nicely done. Um, then taking a look at the back for the back bling, here is the back bling. You see his little ghost guy. Um, also, he has a name. Put it up in the corner as well, just for that information. I forgot to check. Um, very nicely done. You see, like, the little glowing eye in the middle. A little bit of red, bit of gold, bit of mostly white. He is animated. You see, he's jumping about there. Very cool. What not. Whatever you do, emote. Um, he, like, whenever you emote or swing he does like move out of the way a little bit just as like a reaction in some capacity like you see he jolts down there out of the road not sure why exactly but he does and yeah the emote that comes with this called inspect which is currently happening is mainly for his Zavala because it uses his ghost so I'm only showing it with him yeah you see it's like the ghost is looking at something and then they kind of agree yeah let's go this way so yeah that is going to be it for Zavala. I will look at the glider in a separate replay because you can't pull up the gliders in this map. But yeah, that's it for Zavala, his back bling and a sword. Um, let's go take a look at Ikora next. And don't worry, the skins normally do not have the little green outline. That's just also a creative mood thing. So yeah, let's go actually take a look at his Sparrow and then we'll go to look at Ikora. So yeah, let's go. So taking a look at uh, Zavala here, and along with his, well mainly his Sparrow obviously this time, you can see um, uh, Sparrow is very nicely detailed as well. They were very nicely done comparing to the D2 in game design. His is specifically done in red and white, so obviously it matches armor. Um, little blue thrusters there, very nicely done. Um, and then on, oh, on there you can see the um, two eagles, a bit like his chest uh, insignia, and then like the little screen and stuff probably for the speedometer. Um, yeah, the only thing I wish that the uh, Fortnite would have done would be actually having them sit on them instead of them like doing or have fucking surfboarding them. That would have been pretty nice. 
but I think that's the complaint everybody's going to have about them, unfortunately. Like, because they're just sat in the back, if anything, you know, it just looks stupid to them, you know. Now, it looks stupid to the f on only that case, because normally they actually look pretty cool and they suit very well, so yeah. Let's go take a look at Ikora's neck, or well, just, let's just take a look at Ikora next. So, yeah, let's go do that. And here we have Ikora in the same crater of a map. As you can see, very, very nicely done in the case of, you know, keeping it faithful to the actual D2 design. You know, with the purple robes and, well, just her face, from what I remember, looks right. I don't know. Um, yeah, you can kind of just see the red detailing and stuff on her cloak as well. Pretty cool. Um, taking a look at her pickaxe, her, her blade. I... Let's see, kind of basic swinging. It is the black talon, I believe. I'll put it up in the corner just to make sure. Um, very nicely done, I have to admit. I think I prefer this one out of the three the most. Just like it looks very like flowy and elegant instead of just being the master sword for fucking Zelda or just a giant brick, as you'll see in a minute or two. But yeah, um, taking a look at her back bling. Bring it over around here. Here is her ghost, which again, I really should start learning these. Um, I'll, I'll put his name up in the corner as well, just to show uh, information. Um, you can see, I like this ghost a um, bit more than Zavala's because it's like the black ghost with the yellow accents and like the red t tips and whatnot. But yeah, very, very nicely done, I have to admit. I like it. See, it's just as a uh, like emoted and whatnot as Savala's. So, very cute. Um, bringing back around to the front. They also do this emote, which I proved myself wrong in the locker. Um, you see, uh, for Zavala, obviously it had the white ghost, but it actually changes for when you're using black ghost as your back bling, which I think is really fucking awesome. It doesn't unfortunately work with the EXO, which I might show off in there just to show what I mean. But, yeah. You see, again, they're looking about, scanning something, they're like, yeah, let's get to business. And then, pops back up on the back. So, yeah, that is going to be Ikora. Or, going to be it for Ikora. Very, very nice skin. Probably my least favorite though out of the three. Though she's not going to be nearly as bulky in game as um, Zavala because I've already been playing as Zavala for a bit because he was the first on the bot. And oh my good god, he's so fucking bulky. So yeah, let's go take a look at her glider or her version of the Sparrow, and then we'll go take a look at. The Exo Stranger, I think. Yeah, that's the name of it. So yeah, let's go do that. See that. And taking a look at Ikora's Sparrow Glider, we can see it is obviously the exact same model as the other, because it's just a different style to it. Um, but it looks very, very nice, I have to admit. The sort of pink and the darker purpley pink and the red just looks so, so nice. Still probably not my favourite out of the three though. Well, actually I prefer this over the Zavala's, but not as much as the Exos and the Strangers one, so yeah. It looks nice, it sits, uh, sits Ikora a decent bit. The only thing that doesn't really match in her whole set is the uh, her ghost. Like, the ghost being black and yellow does not sit all of this really, but yeah. The only other, you know, the other change that this has compared to his is the thrusters are purple and so it's like the little dials and whatever the fuck those are there and like buttons and whatnot so yeah once again looks stupid because you're standing in or they're sort of gliding on top of it instead of actually sitting on it but what can you do so yeah let's go take a look at the exo stranger and then his glider or their glider her glider i don't know and then we'll finish off the video let's go and last but not least, we have the Exo Stranger, which you can see, very nicely done. 
<coughs> Excuse me. This is kind of the skin we're getting instead of Cade 6, because obviously Cade's kind of kaput. Though I still would have preferred to have our um, Lord and Savior, the Unicorn Man, but not having him, obviously. See, very nicely done. I honestly, I think this is my favorite out of the three. Just, it's not, you know, it's not nearly as bulky as fucking Zavala, so just makes it so much better. Um, I like the, the hood and cape combo and you know, the color scheme just looks very fucking awesome too. Um, looking at their pickaxe, you can see it's the Lamet pickaxe, I believe. I'll put it up in the corner just in case I'm incorrect, which it is a bit of a chainsaw axe and like the little thruster up there is animated as well. Pretty cool. Looks like there's a lot of wires and whatnot. Very, very nicely done. Um, that's how the back X swings. You get a bit of a you know, flame trail from the exhaust, which I think is really cool. Um, yeah, that's it for the back X. Come around the back. You see this little guy is the fish. I don't remember the name of it, so once again I shall put it up on the corner. But the fish doesn't turn around and doesn't animate as much as the ghosts do. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. So you see, little fish, pretty cool. Very nice shade of blue. That's not in focus. Ah, here we go. It's not even focused, I don't think, either. Oh, the fuck it, the ground. Just see. It's very cool looking. It's very bright, colourful. Nice for the blue. And whatnot. So, yeah. As I was saying, um, in Ikora's bit, the emote doesn't work with these two. As you can see, it's just Zavala's um, ghost out again. So... Yeah, the fish does not get included, which is kind of sad, but what can you do? So, yeah, that is going to be it for the Exo Stranger, the Lama Axe, and the fish. We shall now go and look at the Sparrow for the Exo Stranger, and then end the video. So, yeah, let's go do that. And last but not least for this video, we have the... Exo Strangers Glider or version of the Sparrow, which I do think this is my favorite out of the three. You can just see very, very nicely done. It's done in like a metally blue, or well, at least with the lighting, it looks blue. I like the dark blacky blue navy color for the body and whatnot. Back with the blue thrusters and the like blue screen and stuff, but still. I don't know, well, the screen was actually red in Zavala's, but even still, it just looks beautiful. I prefer this over the other two. And, well, then again, you can see it looks absolutely stupid the way he, uh, they're standing on it. But, yeah, you can even see the bit of a design there on the on this bit. No, you can't see it, obviously, up that close, but, yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Um... Yeah, I I really like these cosmetics. My favorite set is probably Zavala overall, purely because of well, I haven't quite decided yet. But with me having played Zavala, he was the first that I got out of the three of these sets. Um, I didn't even get the Sparrow until today either. You know, this is only out yesterday. Um, yeah, I mainly played as Zavala just because he was the one that I wanted out of the three. But yeah. If you guys liked this video, hit the like button, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys know when I go live and when I upload all that good stuff. And yeah, I shall see you guys later on today. That's going up obviously on Friday for 2 p.m. I shall see you guys tomorrow for something else. I'm not quite sure what, if anything. Because honestly, I might just have one video for tomorrow. Upload it at like 3, half 3, maybe even 4. But I don't know. Either you're saying this at 2 p.m. and you're getting a second video, or you're saying it like 2 and probably not getting another video. So I shall see what I can do. But if you don't see another one, tune in on Monday and you'll get something else. But for now, I'm going to go edit this and get it ready. So yeah.
Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. See you guys then. Goodbye.